Next, we're gonna show you how easy it is to access the power module. If you have to access the receiver, you remove the two screws on top of the ESC. That will take off the cap to the water resistant receiver box. Next, if you have to access the servo, there's four screws that remove the servo. But let's now show you how to take the whole module out so if you can have full access. You'll wanna remove the screws that have the dimples next, next to them. There'll be four. You'll also want to remove the actual servo horn screw. By removing the screws, it allows you to have full access to the power module. A cool little feature with the power module, if you have to replace the servo or upgrading the servo, it actually shows you how to install the servo saver right on the box. It shows you where you need to put center on your transmitter and also center on the servo with a nice detailed drawing. And also, it has a little key slot here you line up the arrow to. So once you replace the servo or just want to upgrade everything, once you're done with that, you just reinstall everything, slide everything back in, flip the truck over, install your four screws, And also you'll have the additional the servo horn screw you have to install. Once you do that, you're all set to go. And now that's how easy it is to take out and reinstall the power module in the 4x4 model.